Moving right along to our next guy, we got two more guys we're talking about here on the Ducks Dish podcast. We're talking about Texas offensive lineman Bennett Warren. Bennett Warren is a towering six foot eight, three hundred and twenty pounds, coming out of Fort Bend Christian Academy in Sugarland, Texas. Talk about a highly coveted recruit. He's got nearly thirty reported offers on the recruiting trail. We're seeing him here on the film as a right tackle. And he looks like he's an obvious priority early on for Alik Terry after joining the Oregon staff in February. And it's funny. So Bennett Warren visited Oregon over this past weekend. That's why I'm talking about him on this episode of the podcast. But this was a visit that was a uh, pretty spur of the moment. Matter of fact, uh, his mom had a job interview in Portland and um, they kind of just went out to Portland. Him and his dad got a rental car and they said, hey, can we come hang out at Oregon for a little bit? Um, so really worked out that Oregon was able to get him on campus. And then his mom was also able to come over from what I've seen in the, uh, visit pictures and also spend some time at the university of Oregon on that visit. Um, but the big update that we got from Bennett Warren's visit to Oregon, it was his first time out to Eugene and he liked it so much that he quickly locked in an official visit with the ducks for June 23rd through 25th. And he also has an official visit scheduled to Oklahoma that also comes in June. So two of the five official visits kind of getting, you know, getting uh, coming into focus for Bennett Warren. Um, So this is really good that Oregon's able to continue working in the state of Texas. Um, They also hosted Blake Frazier out of Austin, Texas. He and Bennett Warren were the two main offensive linemen that were on campus for Oregon. Um, Blake Frazier is another big target for Oregon in the 2024 class. I believe he's getting crystal ball to Michigan. Now he went to Michigan right after visiting Oregon. So looks like the Wolverines could be a major target, a major school to watch for Blake Frazier, but back to Bennett Warren. Um, you know, it's really important for the ducks to continue working in the state of Texas. It's a state that's been really kind to them in the past six signees from the 2023 class out of the state of Texas. So we know that this coaching staff has extensive roots in the Lone Star State. You also obviously have Will Stein, you have Tyler Dean, you have Antonio Parks, who just got uh, added to the staff as an offensive analyst. He's going to be big in this uh, in this recruitment or at any recruitment for Oregon that's in Texas and Louisiana, from what I'm told. But this was a big visit for Bennett Warren because he was able to meet Alik Terry get to see that practice. He told me that the camaraderie around that Oregon team around the offensive line was really big for him. um, Seeing that he got to actually be brought into the huddle at the end of practice for Oregon and um, just kind of feel like one of the guys. Right. So I think that was really big that they were able to really put their best foot forward with Bennett Warren. Um, He's talking about how he really liked Khalil, uh, Alik Terry. I almost said Khalil Tate, excuse me. He really likes, Alik Terry's energy that he brings. Um, and he's not, you know, scared away by the fact that he's young because he's like, you know, he's got some really good coaching experience. He's been with the Vikings. He's been at Hawaii and he's had some couple places around the country. So um, he's just a fun person to be around is what he'd say. And, and watching practice was his favorite part. So um, I asked him one of my favorite questions to ask recruits now is what kind of message Oregon is sending. And he said, the message that they sent is quote, that the Ducks are here to stay, uh, the Ducks are there to stay, that they're there to make their statement as being one of my favorite all-time schools. So it looks like Oregon is in an awesome spot here, but they're not alone in their pursuit of the massive offensive linemen out of Texas. Schools like Oregon, Oklahoma, Tennessee, Texas, FSU, and LSU are all schools that he's hearing from the most right now in his recruitment, and he is looking to have his recruitment wrapped up with a commitment either before this season, right before the season starts, or maybe about halfway through the season is what Warren was telling me. So the Ducks are doing a great job trying to trying to really stand out in this pursuit for offensive linemen. Um, I think that they really signed a lot of offensive linemen. I think it was seven or eight last year. Uh, if you talk about a Johnny Cornelius, Junior Angelau from the portal, and then I think they had five or six guys from the high school or JUCO rankings um, is you just got to keep giving yourself options there. So maybe they don't take as many as they did in 2023, but offensive line is still definitely a priority, I think, on the recruiting trail in the 2024 class, especially given the fact that it's a new era at the offensive line, not only because Alik Terry takes over that group, but because you lose so many veterans from the 2023 season, um, I think that you just got to continue giving yourself more options there. 
And uh, it looks like Bennett Warren is a top option for the Ducks on the recruiting trail at the offensive line spot. 